Becoming a dog breeder is never something that you should do lightly and never something that you should decide upon without many hours of consideration and planning. If you are going to be breeding dogs, then there are some things that you should think carefully about. Breeding dogs is something that requires a lot of hard work and something that requires a lifetime commitment on your part. Therefore, if you are going to be breeding dogs, there should be some major aspects of your life that revolve around dogs. First of all, a love for dogs is a great start, but it should not be the only reason that you think you would be a good dog breeder. A love for dogs is very important because you are going to be spending many hours of each of your days raising puppies, working with your dogs, and making sure that they are healthy. Loving them is important, yes, but loving them is not the only thing that is important because just love alone can only get you so far. Besides loving your dogs, you are going to need to be a dog person. This is different from loving dogs. Loving dogs might mean that you enjoy having them, that you keep them around and take them out when needed, and might even let them sleep on the bed once in a while. Being a dog person is much different. Being a dog person means that you find dog hair in your soup and don't mind, and that your dogs usually live more comfortably than you do. If you are a dog person, you would never dream of allowing your dogs to be out in the cold weather, and you wouldn't ever expect them to live in conditions that you wouldn't live in yourself. If you are a dog person, you read everything there is to read about your particular dog breed, and you study all of it to find out the things that you should be doing. A dog person might joke that their life revolves around their dogs, and they are probably right. Therefore, in order to be a good breeder, you have to be these things. You have to be willing to work with your dog breeds and to make sure that you are doing all that you can do to provide dogs with good homes. You must be diligent and ready to work for the common good of the breed. And the bottom line when it comes to dog breeding is that you must not be in it at all for the money. The money should never be a motivation for dog breeding. And so if this is your main motivation, it is time for you to step back and look for another hobby.